What's up, everyone? This is Tech Trooper 64 and today we have an article on the PlayStation Vita. Now, I didn't actually give a review on the PlayStation Vita at all yet, but I am actually a pretty big fan of the PlayStation Vita. I do love my 3DS, but the Vita is... I gotta say, it's a pretty good handheld. I enjoy it a lot. I play it a lot even now. My friend's actually borrowing it right now, but I do play it a lot. And I love that little handheld. But, unfortunately, the article I have here about the PlayStation Vita is unfortunately very, very, very negative. Yeah. So, it looks like that in the Netherlands, Sony has officially discontinued the PlayStation Vita. Yikes. So the link I'll have for you guys in the in the description below is actually from a German website. It's all in German. In Dutch, I guess you could say. Um, so I would recommend that you play that on, I think, open the link in either Firefox. I'm not sure if Microsoft Edge does it, but Firefox or Google Chrome, and it'll translate it to English for you. But if not, just copy and paste it to Google Translate. It's not hard. But anyway, it is in Dutch. If you can speak Dutch, great, <laughs> then go read it. But if not, I translated it, that's how I'm going to read it. So, here we go. Sony seems to have stopped the sale of the PlayStation Vita in Benelux. The company refuses to comment, but lets merchants to tw uh, but it has told merchants to tweakers, yeah, it's really broken English, I just want to say it too, that no new stock is to be expected. In other European countries, the Vita is ordered. Although there is still a price indication that the PlayStation Vita is in price watch state, that goes to the final stock of shop selling of the 3G version. Wow, they actually still have the 3V, 3G version over there? But anyway, the article goes on to say how the PlayStation Vita is no longer being stocked all over in the Netherlands, and that it's not even being stocked back again. Sony hasn't said anything official about it. Sony of Europe hasn't commented on it either. However, it is said that apparently the stock that stores have for the PS Vita will be the final stock, apparently. Wow. Also in February, it was known that the production of the PlayStation TV was ended as well. Yikes. So I guess this is kind of the beginning of the end for the PlayStation Vita. Now, I enjoy the PlayStation Vita. It got a lot of good games, third-party games too. I enjoyed it, but, you know, I kind of understand where the Vita went wrong. And I'm not going to go too much into it, but it's sad to see the Vita is going to die this way. But, hey, it was... I guess it just didn't do well enough. I just hope that Sony's not giving up on the handheld dedicated gaming market. I know that Shuhei Yoshida has already commented on the possibility of a PlayStation Vita uh, successor, but to tell you the truth, I think they should stay in the race, uh, the dedicated gaming race. Because maybe they don't need to make um, like another PS Vita, but at least try to compete a little bit, you know, just give competition to Nintendo, because if Nintendo, like, owns the entire mobile marketplace for, uh, dedicated gaming handhelds, it's like, it's, there's no point to do it anymore, right? So, I kind of want a successor to the v PS Vita. Anyway, what do you, what do you guys think about the discontinuation of the PlayStation Vita in the Netherlands? Do you agree with so what Sony's doing? And do you agree with my opinion when I say that Sony should make another PlayStation Vita? Don't forget to rate, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.